Welcome to the Toffee Blues, your source for all things Everton. Uh, this is my reaction to the, the news that Fabian Delph has just signed a three-year deal at Everton to summer uh, 2022. A uh, 29-year-old midfielder slash left-back. Um, so very versatile player. Um, so uh, my reaction, I think, at first, when I first heard, and I think a lot of Evertonians will be with me on this one, um, I wasn't too sure when I heard Fabian Delph was linked with Everton. But then when we heard the price tag, I think that was the deciding factor that kind of made Evertonians think this couldn't be too bad of a deal. 8.5 initial fee with a believed 1.5 further in add-ons. I think that's the deal um, that's been signed. So for that price tag, you can't really go wrong for a decent... Whether he'll be a squad player or whether he will be in the first team remains to be seen, but he can provide obviously options of both left-back and across midfield. Um, probably defensive midfield and not further up to provide... Back up for Gilfie Sigerson, I doubt, I doubt he'd be played in the position. It probably will be to provide competition for for Idris Gay and Andre Gomez and uh, obviously Morgan Stradlin as well. Um, but where he'll be in that pecking order will be interesting, probably ahead of Stradlin and um, chasing, chasing Gay and Gomez. I'm not sure if he starts ahead of him, that's a thing. So um, I'm happy about the signing. Um, obviously, he's a, he's, a, he's a good quality player. Pep Guardiola obviously saw something in him to give him a chance at City and he he did have a chance he wasn't um, I think Guardiola's been, been he's not scared of getting players out of the club if he doesn't want them there and he he hasn't done that um, he's been at City for a few years now and he's uh, he's kept Delph as a pretty valuable member of his squad but obviously uh, um, an office coming for him and he, he's decided to let him go and um, I think it's a it's, it's a it's a good it's a good addition to the Everton squad uh, we do need squad depth and, and players that can cover positions and um, it'll be interesting to see where he does play and whether he does start, uh, for Everton next season. But I'm pretty happy with the, pretty happy with the deal, and I think most of Evertonians are as well. There's been a, considering the 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 initial, um, a little bit of dismay um among Evertonians. It seems to be all positive now, which uh, which has turned things around a lot, which is brilliant. I had a little chat with um Harry Meller from City Extra today, which is also on Toffee Blues YouTube. If you want to go and have a look, um, where he. Spoke to me a little bit about Fabian Delph and his time at Man City and what he can bring to Everton really and it's put it in a bit of a positive light and um it's kinda of warmed me to the signing of Fabian Delph. So I'm excited to be honest to see him in blue and um see how we'll get on. See him in real blue and see how we'll get on for Everton next season under Marco Silva and um, Marco Silva seems to be pretty happy with that anyway. Obviously, um a lot of people have been saying about his leadership. Um he wasn't captain of Man City but um, in the in the documentary, uh, which did him a lot of good, he showed some leadership qualities, and obviously there's that there's that um the speech he gave in the Man City dressing room that's going around, um on social media, um about taking him back to the basics of football. I think we've seen enough of the basics of football with Sam Allardyce, but no, I think um Delph has showed leadership qualities, and that's what a, a lot of Man City fans seem to be saying. So, um a lot of Everton fans as well last season said we need to buy a leader, uh, a natural born leader, and I think Delph can provide us with that, um. So, that's why I think I'm happy with with that deal. To be honest, if he was just a squad player, it would be an alright signing. But the fact that he can bring leadership as well and a winning mentality, obviously, he's won plenty of things at Man City. Um, I think that adds a, another bit of um, another little bit of winning mentality. They haven't seen much needed really, and I think it will hopefully drive us to the next level. So I'm excited about the signing. But uh, let us know what you think as well in the comments. Um, whether you Happy or uh, still dismayed about the, the signing of Fabian Delva. I'm pretty happy. Yeah, I've warmed to it. Um, and do give that video I've done with uh, with Harry a watch as well, which is also on the Toffee Blues channel. It's called Scout Report Fabian Delph. But yeah, uh, let us know what you think in the comments. And obviously like this video and subscribe to the Toffee Blues and join us next time. Thanks for watching.